My name is Matthew Mungo, and I'm a makeup effects artist. I'm presenting with Adam Scott Road, a sculpture, which is the Four Night Here and the Willy Wonka. We've gone into collaboration together on our artistic abilities, and I'm very honored to be helping him with a few of the pieces. Today is really, you're looking at the collaboration of two individuals that have had some incredible success in their career, and we're coming together. And you're looking at this merging of pop culture. I've always been a film buff. So pop culture kind of wove itself into, you know, what my love and fascination was for. What I'm excited about is this show is the first introducing of Academy Award winner Matthew Mungle and my work together. It's very exciting to work and connect with someone that has amassed such an incredible portfolio of movies and the pieces they've built. It's historic in a lot of ways because you're looking at an industry in the cinema and even in art where a computer is becoming the art form. So is a lot of the special effects and makeup and uh, some of the sets, all these different things. So what Matthew and I are doing is we're kind of merging into our own and bringing that vintage feeling back and doing it by hand. I'm doing a presentation today uh, making a model into an alien. I've got a big head, prosthetic piece that goes onto his face and some ears. But I love doing makeup like that because it's so inventive and creative. I, I just want to see what comes of it. My start in makeup effects started when I was a child, but I love monster movies. And I was just amazed at how the makeup artist would turn the actors into different characters. And uh, moved out to Hollywood in 1977. Went to the Joe Blasco Makeup Center to learn makeup. After that, I taught there for a little while and then started working on my own projects. And then it just snowballed from there. The hardest thing for me, it's not the illustration, it's coming up with that concept. Like the one behind me here is Alice in Wonderland, but it's Alice 30 something. And it took me six years to imagine what would Alice in Wonderland be, or how I would interpret my vision of Alice. You have to be careful because collectors will ask me, how long did that take you? And I said, 55 years. And they look at me like, what? And I said, well, you know, I'm gonna be 55 this year. And from what I did at 18 or 20 years old to what I can do now took me that long. So hopefully I can do it in a shorter period of time because I've gotten very good at my technique. So when I get around someone like Academy Award winner Matthew Mungle for his stature and what he does in his imagination, it's like magic. After 40 years in Hollywood, I just decided that was enough of Hollywood. And and I think it's my time to shine and do what I want to do instead of having to do what the producers and the directors want me to do. I do seminars now, I teach a little bit, so I'm very happy with where I'm at right now.